looking live at downtown Birmingham as the local chapter of the NAACP and supporters are heading to Montgomery for the parole hearing of Thomas Blanton. The bus is scheduled, scheduled to leave at 5.30 and CBS 42 News reporter Mike McClanahan is live in Montgomery where Blanton's parole hearing will take place in just a few hours. Good morning, Mike. Good morning, Jamie, and there will be a decision today. That's what I'm hearing from the general counsel for the Alabama Board of Pardons and Paroles, although Thomas Blanton himself will not be here. That is because the Department of Corrections simply cannot bring defendants from the various prisons across the state here to Montgomery. Blanton is being held in the St. Clair County Correctional Facility, and according to Department of Corrections records, he is serving a sentence of 999 years, 99 months, and 99 Nine days for four counts of murder. Those, of course, for the lives of the four little girls that were taken in the horrific crime that shocked the world, involving the bombing at the 16th Street Baptist Church. And although Blanton himself is not expected to be at the hearing, the parole board does expect a lot of people based purely on the number of uh, people they've had to notify by state law. They are anticipating quite a crowd, particularly for those who will most likely protest the possibility of parole. And of course, we, we're hearing that there will be people taking a bus or buses down here for the hearing. The building is actually opening about 30 minutes early at 7 o'clock, and there will be security, security checks today because of the nature of this case. Of course, we'll have updates throughout the morning and continue throughout the day. But for now, I'll send it back to you in the studio live in Montgomery. Mike McClanahan, CBS 42 News.